Hello everybody, welcome again on helpinwordpress.com, an online resource of WordPress help. In today video tutorial, we will learn how we can use a press this word button in WordPress. Today world is full of information and everybody trying to build his or her web presence using their blog. People get ideas from other websites and write down that in this word to publish on their blog. But while reading online, sometimes we will want to bookmark that article headings for later use. WordPress provide press this functions which is available in the WordPress make this easy for a user first we will see how we can enable this press this button in wordpress so uh, we will first move into the settings part and then go for the writing this is the writing section of wordpress here you can see you have one button called press this and as written just above this drag and drop the following link to your bookmarks bar or right click it and add to your favorite for a posting shortcut so uh, we are just dragging that from here to your bookmark toolbar and leaving there it is asking me to give it a name so i'm just uh, writing publish on helping wordpress and saving this you can see we have another bookmark available in bookmark toolbar so from the setup perspective we have done our part now suppose if you want to use that button to publish or save any article on your website just follow these steps uh, we will open another link and just opening the CNN website and you can see we have various articles here I'm just writing opening up okay so this is the article we have and we want to use that on our website what I will do after the page load I will click on this publish on WordPress button it will open a new window with the title it's specified for your WordPress post and the URL of that blog post. You have two options here. The first one is the save draft and second one is publish. For the later use you can publish this from here and save it in the save draft section or you can directly publish on your blog. You can also add some tags here and you can specify the categories also you can specify a new category here and you can click on the save draft button i'm just hitting the save draft button and it will save it in our sections let me just close this window from here open our admin all post section you can see we have our newly created post here the another great feature of this press this button is suppose I have any website where uh, let me just find some okay let me just open this so this is the blog post from wordpress.com and we want to use that in our program what I will do I will again click this publish on button it is written like here another feature which you will see here you can also copy the content 
just select this content here and publish on WordPress. You can see you will get the all tags which is selected as the content of your post and with the title part. You can publish that, you can save it for later use. So I'm just again hitting the save draft. It will save this post. We can close this window. Second features, which we will see, you can directly import any image while using the press this button. You can see this post contain one image here I will click on the publish on button and you have an option called insert an image when I click this it will read this post and fetch the image from there for your post so these are the various images available on this post you can click on any image and insert this image in your post and publish on your blog so this is basically a very good tool from the wordpress which always help people to publish things on the fly there are some drawbacks we can see while using the press this button the first one is we do not have scheduling option while publishing using the pub press this button you can see if I am clicking this publish on WordPress there is no option available of schedule so you cannot schedule your WordPress post from this window the second things the plugins which are generally available on your new post section any SEO plugin featured image plugin excerpt anything that is not available in this section you cannot upload your image from this section too so these are the some drawback of press this button but as you can see there are so many options available the basic functionality of press is to publish your post on the fly which I think this button serves better so it's time to create your own post using the press this button we will come back with some another videos in the later sections till then happy blogging